Good evening and welcome to the Daily News Roundup with Daily Mirror Online. You're with me, Bhaktia Be Surya. Let's take a look at our headlines. Economic crisis in Sri Lanka has gotten worse. Both doses of vaccine compulsory by early next year. Veteran film director Sunil Somapiris passes away. No power cuts from today. University registration extended till the 16th of December. New Zealand to ban cigarettes for future generations. Now diving into those stories in detail. UNP Deputy Leader Ruan Vijayvardhana stated that the economic crisis in Sri Lanka has got worse while the government has fallen out with both China and India. Mr Vijayvardhana made these remarks at a meeting he had with party activists yesterday. Health Minister Kehliya Rambukwella stated that receiving two doses of COVID-19 vaccine will be made mandatory by early next year. He told reporters yesterday that it would take at least three months to finalize this. Veteran film director Sunil Somapiris has passed away at the age of 72. He is also known as the king of box office in the Sinhala cinema. He was a prolific director who directed the most number of films in Sri Lankan cinema with 45 commercial films in various genres to his name. The Ministry of Power and Energy stated that there will be no power cuts in any parts of the country from today. According to the Ministry, the second and third generators of the Norochole power plant, which were recently shut down, have been reconnected to the national grid. The University Grants Commission has decided to extend the closing date of accepting online applications for university admission. UGC Chairman Sampath Amaratunga stated that the decision has been made to extend the online registration until the 16th of December. New Zealand will ban the sales of tobacco to its next generation in a bid to eventually face out smoking. Anyone born after 2008 will not be able to buy cigarettes or tobacco products in their lifetime under a law expected to be enacted next year. For further details on the stories, visit our website www.dailymirror.lk. Thank you for tuning in. I'm Bhakti Abe Surya and this is the Daily News Roundup.